winter is coming, which means we must always be warm and have constant vigilance. Yes, we need to build our walls to keep the DDoS attacks and data hackers out. So how do I keep my dragons, or better yet, people in check from releasing confidential data? Mobile dragon management, duh -uh. Or in Google's terms, mobile device management for G Suite. I think we need to see a demo. All right, let's jump into it. So this is how the G Suite admin console looks like. First, you need to set up the Apple push notification certificate in the console to establish a connection to the Apple push notification service, which is um, called, popularly called the APNS service, so that G Suite MDM, or any other MDM for that matter, can efficiently send commands to all your managed iOS device fleet. To set it up, you download a certificate signing request from the console, upload it into the Apple push, certification, uh, push certificate portal by logging in with your Apple ID. You'll then receive a signed certificate from Apple. Download that signed certificate and upload it back in the G Suite admin console here. You're now ready to roll. You can enable MDM in the setup and can choose if each device that is being enrolled needs to be approved by an admin before it gets the settings. You can set up password policies, be it basic, standard, or strong. You also have some additional settings on the device that you can control, like um, you can pick if notifications are allowed to be viewed on the lock screen, um, and if you want managed apps to be able to sync using mobile data, or um, if you want the user to be able to back up the device with iCloud, some Safari settings and some specific settings around photos, screen capture, and Siri. Now, once you as an admin have decided and applied all these settings, you want to enforce on these devices. You just have to turn on device management, send out communications to your employees to start enrolling their devices. Now, uh, let's see what the user experience looks like. So this is my iPad. I have my personal Gmail on it. To enroll a device, you uh, first have to download the Google device policy app from the App Store. And then, once it downloads, you log in with your G Suite account. This is my super secret password. Um, accept the terms and conditions and install the profile. This is the G Suite MDM profile. It takes a bit. At this point, if you have required admin approval, the user won't see anything till the admin approves this device. I've set it up for automatic approval though, so it's pretty instant. We need to put in our password one more time to sync email. It has synced mail, contacts, and calendar here in the native mail app. Now let's go check out our mail. There's two accounts here, my personal Gmail and the G Suite work account. Now let's say I lost this device. The G Suite admin can simply wipe my corporate email from the console sitting in his office and ensure that all the work data is safe. Here's the device we just enrolled. Since this is my personal device, I'll only have the admin wipe my work email and leave everything else on there. If it's a corporate device, we can potentially wipe the whole device too. The command has been sent. Going back to the device, you can see that there's only one account now, my personal one. That's it, it's as simple as that. Wow, that was pretty amazing. For sure, we're gonna win the throne with that one. If only winning thrones was as easy as mobile device management with Google Cloud. If you wanna get in touch with us, go ahead and click on the link below. And if you like what you saw today, please like, share, and subscribe.